this is the puzzle that we're trying to do. It's butterflies. So we've already separated the straights and the corners from the middle pieces, yeah. and we have the straight pieces, and we've already started doing a line yes. here of straight pieces, but they're all white. There's no color in them, so we can't tell if it's the top or the bottom, so we might actually be doing this upside down. We might have to turn it over. Um, but you know, we've already started separating some of the colors um, by the colors of the butterflies uh, so that when we get to that point we can start doing the middle. But I just wanted to show how we were doing the straight pieces. Since they're all white, uh, we can't really go by colors. So what we've been doing is we made separate piles of the straight pieces that are left into piles that have two Audi uh, pieces uh, on each side. Um, and then another pile of where they have uh, two innies inner in, inset or innies, we're just going to call them innies. Uh, so that's all the innies and then this is a pile of mixed innie and outie. So when we go to compare, um, so if we're trying to find the matching piece for that one uh, and we need uh, a piece with an outie, uh, we just will be looking at these and those and we don't have to look at these right now. So it kind of makes things go faster. And instead of picking up every piece and trying to make it fit um, what we're gonna do is just take the piece that we're interested in fitting and we know we need a fitting piece on the on the bottom part here we're just gonna gonna go around and you can kinda tell that you know we need a larger curve on the right side so that's clearly not gonna work and we're just gonna kinda go around and try to find something and if the piece has some more um, let's see that one doesn't work if the piece has some more uh, really uh, pro pronounced kinks in it like this one uh, they can be a little easier to find but uh, this one's a little bit more generic so we'll just kinda go around and when they fit they fit you know it's just this, this thing with puzzles is when they fit they fit and you'll know it you know there's no need to force it um, so we're just going to kind of go around. That one looks close, but it's having to be forced. So we just kind of go, you know. So we don't have to check this pile because, you know, it's all innies. So that one, and, uh, oh, there it is right there. So we can kind of put that in there in the puzzle and now we can move on to this one. So with this one we need uh we need to match it up with an with an Audi and it's kind of got both uh angles kind of tilting up a little bit so we kind of want to look for something like that. Um, so it's not going to work so we don't need to check for these because we need a uh no that's not quite it. So, no, that's not quite it. And, no, nope, that's not quite right. No, that one would have to be forced. We don't want to do that. So, no, 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 no. No, 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 there, right there. So we got that one, so then we'll go and uh, go. And since these are all white, we don't know if this is actually upside down. The only clue we have is that some of these straight pieces have shadows on them. And we know that's the right side of the puzzle because the, some of the butterflies on the right side have shadows, uh, but not they don't have shadows on the left side. So we'll see if some of these shadow pieces, if they don't end up fitting on this side of the puzzle, then they do go over here. Or if they do fit over here, then I've got this line upside down and I need to turn it over. So then once we finish the straight pieces, we'll start separating by color the butterflies and then start doing the, uh, the inside. So that's all I wanted to say. Do you have anything to say, Sophia? Oh, yes. What do you have well, to say? 
So, like I was pronouncing my other video, that you might see if you buy it. Well, if you buy it next garage sale. I think Grandpa's going to sell them. What, the puzzle? Yes. You're going to sell the puzzle? I don't know. Um, no, we're not going to sell the videos. Okay, so, what I'm thinking is this is kind of tricky, because that has blue in it. Uh -huh. And you know what? Hmm. Like, it's easy if we only look at the pitch. So let's see. Let's have it over here. So that's purple. It looks like this. Yeah, that looks like the light purple one on top. Mm -hmm. So we can put that in the pile for the top purple one. Yes. And start making some right. some piles of color. Right here, because it looks like it's going to be right here. Okay. And that has an antenna from this one, because you know why? Mm -hmm. The antenna is from the purple. So what I'm thinking, all right, is this is the baby's clothes. Okay. And well, that's wanna, the blue part, and that's the... Do you want to work on that, and I'll continue to work on the side pieces, and then we'll start working on the colors together? Okay. So that's what we'll do. Bye.